Hi guys, how are you doing? Uh, welcome to the channel. If this is the first time here, kindly, kindly, kindly consider to like and subscribe and click on that notification bell. And so today is on Sunday. Oh, okay, there is no much going on. Actually, the city is, I don't know. And um, I'm going to look for something to eat. I don't know why my skin is so dry. My skin is drying up so fast. I don't know what's up. Oh my goodness, today it's on Sunday. And nothing nothing much going on. A lot of people don't open their shops on Sunday. So, and I'm looking for something to eat. Uh, wow. Um... Guys, I'm going to look for something to bite. And I was going to get some bajiyas. We have some, um, how do you call it, some local bajiyas. And the woman is not there. Oh my goodness. The woman is not there. So, and the way I've come from far, she's usually in that spot over here. She's usually there. And she's not there. Whoa. Anyway, let me try my luck. Let me try my luck and see if I can find somewhere else. Yeah, so how are you guys? How are you doing? Today it's on Sunday, as I said. And this place is so deserted. Like, we don't have shops open, you know. So where are you watching from? Kindly comment below. Let me know. Let's interact, you know. And uh, did you go to church? Do you go to church on Sunday? Or do you go to church on Saturday? Let me know. You know, today I was not able to go to church. I I don't know. I woke up so late. And uh, yeah, it's kind of a boring day anyway. But... Um, let me show you the outfit, what I'm wearing. That's what I'm wearing. A very long sweater. A very long sweater. Yeah. They sell secondhand household there. Let me turn my camera. Let me show you how this place looks like. So I I am going to get something and I don't know where I'll get uh open shops. You see? Shops are, are not opened. That's how bad it is on Sunday. So you see? Ooh. Anyway, yeah. That's how the place looks like. Uh, I've seen avocado somewhere, so I can try and let me ask the price. Hi, Sasa, avocado no zaje? Ni ile tamu ya mafuta? Unajui, macho, macho udanganya? Amisi picha ni video na ni mini YouTube content, ni mini YouTuber. Ebunta fiti le poa. Ya thati. Na zali para mpesa. Aki nta fiti le tamu ndio ni rudi. Enge wanjua. Ya hile minioja. Umeiva poa. Saa. Thank you very much. Smile. So I'm still looking for something to eat, and I'm in the busiest streets around where I stay. Oh. 
at least this side some people are open so let me show you how busy this place is actually weekdays from monday to saturday this week is usually this street is usually so uh, so busy uh, again let me turn my camera let me show you what's going on here so you see on Sunday we have people who put their stuffs on the road and they sell it you know Sasa Malenge Nile tamu Nikati ngine Moza Kwa hii Eh Malenge kira moza Kwa hii Eh Jyo hii oza Sasa Staki zingine unapata ngine ni mzuri ngine ni maji Sana Ni moza Sasa Ni moza Sasa Sawa Oh so I was not supposed to cook but I've decided to buy how do you call this malenge so yeah a piece this is 20 20 shillings this is 20 shillings okay Yo. So I've decided to take two pieces, so they'll be enough. Uh, yeah. Sante. Sini for box, sasa moja. Sini ya? Mwanya ni sabi ya moja ni kwa. <laughs> oh my goodness. But we at least now to kona vitungu. So guys, we few weeks ago we used to buy these these one piece for 10 shillings. That's how bad it was. Eh? Oh. One piece was a piece of onion was 10 shillings. Or even more, depending on where you live. So 10, 15, 30, 40, 50. Yeah. Twenty-five, twenty-five. Ah, zangu tume uka Isn't really na ingi na chini. Gosh, karaka sangu ndio beto boka. Onion yangu miangu ndio yo. But this is a cafe. Oh, can I pepper? Yeah, ten. I'm a member. I'm a. What's that? You need to buy it. You need money to angush. What's that? You need to angush. Sante. So there is this food combo that I love: gizeri and pumpkins. And I want to add spinach. How much spinach? Ten. I have 40. I have not taken two kids. You need to. Not taken here. You need to cut your meat. Please, eh? Eh? Yeah, ten bob. Ten shillings. Ah, you need to wash. Oh, I can't go and buy one. You need to go go. Okay. You need to cut a kabisa. Ama ikoto sawa. Rusha ya fifty apa? Asante. Aye. 
And so I decided to buy Giveri because I find it so easy to prepare and it has all the nutrients that I need in my body. And for those of you who don't know what Giveri is, Giveri is a combination of maize and legumes or do I say maize and kidney beans? Anyway, depending on how you want to prepare your Giveri. And did I say that Giveri is a traditional meal here in Kenya? Or let me say in East Africa, depending on where you're coming from, you know. But for me, for me, Giveri will be my favorite any day, any time because it's very easy. Actually, if you're not, if you don't want to cook, if you don't want to, you know, if you're tired and you're hungry, this one meal that it's very easy for you to prepare. You know, for me, I can eat it without um, anything. I just sprinkle a little bit of salt you know, and make my strong tea aside and I call it a day. And trust me, ooh, you have no idea. You have no idea how, how life-saving this thing is, you see. So I decided to buy like three cups. Uh, we have two different sizes. For me, I decided to go with the small size, 20 shillings per cup, which is I think it's $0.13 if I am not wrong, and we call it a day. One thing I'm sure of is that it will serve me for like two meals, okay? So guys, let's go home and see what next. Uh, okay. Oh, let me get tomatoes. Karibu ni sahau nyanya. Thirty shillings, uh, Tisa. So you want any more apa? Thank you. Uh,
So this is what I got, uh, pumpkins, avocado, we've got spinach, we've got berry, and we've got tomato. Yep. So that's what we're going to prepare today. And we call it a day. So this will be enough. For and the whole of this food costed me like 200 Kenya shillings, which I find it so fair, you know, and at least it's going to last for few meals, which is fair for me. And that's why I like cooking in the house. It's economical, it saves, and it's healthy, you know. Anyway, guys, I want to say thank you for sticking until the end. I will see you to the next one. Bye.